Hi, we are Group 7, uh, John, Jason, Jason and Alex. Uh, this is our arcade uh, basketball game, uh, utilizing 3D printing, uh, stepper motor, limit switch, uh, tilt ball switch, and a one digit seven segment display. So it all starts, you can hit the reset button or you can plug the thing in and the room will move all the way to the left side where it runs into the limit switch. Once it makes contact with the limit switch, it will move back out just slightly. Um, and then from there, that it's its own position, and uh, I'll be able to start just uh, putting the ball in the hoop, and it'll begin to move at random positions. So, there you go. So now I can just drop this in. I will not be throwing the ball since I was never good at sports. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so now that we programmed an R, um, a random number generator in Arduino to allow the basket to move within two, to move to a random position within two uh, predetermined points. So it'll stop momentarily. Uh, here we go. And now it will probably move to the left, like so. And it will stop once again somewhere along here. As you can see in the LA, on the uh, digital display, that is keeping track of our score. So that is also counting up as each shot is made. And it will not hit the limit switch again because when it moved over a little bit, uh, that was its it, that was its defined uh, left bound. And finally, uh, with one shot left, you'll see the score is at nine. Um, once it reaches the score of nine and you make another shot, the scoreboard will return to zero, and the hoop will return, it'll, sorry, it'll return uh, back to its original place from where it first started. Once again, it'll hit the limit switch and then return to its original position.